She has lived her life completely out of order. Uh, kid, then moved, then dated. <laughs> oh, dated is putting it. Yeah, there's a couple <laughs> of dudes that were there, and then now uh, it's worked out. It Baby, has. house, a loving, uh, loving husband. We do ask Riley on the show where you ask Riley something, and she gives her her best advice, as read by as read by Eric. Hola. Yes, all right, hey. Eric. What do we have for today? All right, Riley. Yeah. Love your no BS take on things on the show. You seem you've had people wrong you a time or two in your life. So I got to ask, do you believe in revenge or do you not hold grudges and tend to let things go? Oh. My man. Okay. <sighs> revenge. I don't believe in revenge. So I'm not the person that, as my now husband likes to describe it, that likes to watch the knife go in. I don't like to see the wound bleed when someone gets their karma. I don't like to stick around for that. It doesn't make me feel good as a human. Do I believe in karma? 100%. Do I believe that people deserve karma when they've wronged somebody over and over and over again? Yes. Because I think there's a chance for people to be good in life, and sometimes karma teaches you that. I've been the recipient of karma of being a jerk myself, mm. so I think it teaches you a lesson, but I'm not the one that wants to stick around and watch the pain happen. Like, once you're out of my stratosphere, like, once you've hurt me and I get to get away from you, I don't want to mess with you anymore. Mm -hmm. I don't want to see what happens to you. I don't want to, like, be watching as, like, your your whole, like, karma, what am I saying? Karmic <laughs> retribution comes around. Mm -hmm. I'm not the one that wants to see it happen. Do I believe it should happen? Yeah. Ease. But am I vengeful? I don't. I would like to think I'm not. I don't think you are. I don't think I have time for it. No, I don't think because you are. I'm the type of person that once I get that to that place, it's ugly. Like I always tell people, I'm nice until I'm not. So I try to get to the not. So, <laughs> do I believe in revenge? No. Do I believe in karma? One hundred percent. Same. I mean, am I wrong? It's like I'd be stupid to say that. Like I, when people have. <sighs> To the core of me hurt me. John, you know. You know a lot 100%. about my background and you know a 100%. lot about what I've gone through in terms of relationships and things. And I'm not even just talking about boyfriends. Like, do I believe that people should get their due when they really hurt you to your core? Yeah. I'm not perfect. I'm not an angel by any means. But I don't want to be there when it happens. No, I mean... Listen, look we're, at your no, face. No, we're, I mean, I, me, I'm a little bit different, but that wasn't, it was not asked John, it's asked Riley. So. But I mean, Thank I think you. it's no, different for Riley. everybody. I think the reason why, because I'm not trying to pretend like I'm so perfect and I just, I'm so innocent. It's not that. It's just when I get to that nicer, I'm nice until I'm not, when I get to the not stage, I'm evil. Mm -hmm. I'm ugly. And it's not a great space for me to be. It's not a great thing to teach my kids because I'm not the person when you mess with me that it'll go over well. So I tend to just try my hardest to put it there, put it in the past, say bless your heart and keep moving. To usad out. Mm -hmm. I think that's good. <laughs> You're I, laughing no. because you've seen yeah. where I go no, when yeah, I get no. to that icky yeah. place. But he's I also know. laughing too because he's the complete opposite of what you are no, saying. I, I don't think that that's wrong though. I think that because listen, my husband is... He wants to watch the blood flow. He wants to watch the knife go in. He wants to yeah. see the retribution. He wants. He will sit Why? there... Yeah. Because that's how he plan, like he deals with things, and he because for him sometimes his driving force is the haters be your motivators mm -hmm. thing, and that's what makes him move mountains in life. Hundred percent. But like I said, he's a better person than I am that he can do that and keep it going. I will fester. I'll keep going. So I don't like to seek the revenge. That's not for me. I think success is the best revenge there is. Right. And that that will eat somebody for life. Yeah. That, that's. What are you looking at me like that for, Eric? Him, I'm looking at him because there's a lot there that he, when he says that, I, I'm just like, okay, buddy. But, but I you think, also need to like, I think you need to grow too, John. I, I am. I've been, and, seen, been therapy. Be, this, is, this isn't about me, Eric. This is Ask Riley. But I think You'll that everybody, it, but, but I mean, it's for everybody. Yeah, so I think that exactly. everybody has their own form of dealing with the things that have wronged you. And I think that's also okay. Sure. I think it would be boo-boo of me to say like, no, you can't ever get revenge. You're wrong if you get revenge because I don't think that way. I think for me and the ugly place that I will take it to, revenge can't be a sit. It can't be in my stratosphere because I, it'll eat me alive. I think that's fair. That's awesome. If you have a question for uh, Ask Riley, DM her at Riley Couture.